Hi, welcome to Luna Logic Tarot. I'm Juju, and this is going to be a um, warnings message for Gemini. You could have Gemini in your Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus placements. Please keep in mind, Gemini, that these readings are very general, so take what resonates, leave the rest. If it's not your story, don't try to make it fit. Everything is subject to free will, and the will of the divine, no one is free from law of cause and effect. Um, also, roles can be reversed. Gemini, this can apply to any area of your life. It can involve relationships, romantic, friendships, um, family dynamics. It can involve your regular life, your working life, your spiritual life, okay? These messages could be something that you're doing that you need to stop doing, and this is your warning. Or this could be something that's going on around you, or something that, a uh, situation that's going on around you, or something that someone else is doing, so please keep that in mind. I will be reading it as you, though, okay? So, but again... Take what resonates, leave the rest. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like this video. I really appreciate you being here. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for all your continued love and support. I greatly appreciate that more than you could possibly know. It means the world to me. All right, let's see. So what I would got when I was meditating on your energy was sit down. Sit down and listen, okay? So there's something that you need to hear. Either somebody's trying to get you to sit down and listen to them, or Spirit's trying to get you to sit down and listen to Spirit, or you need to sit down and listen to this reading, okay? Let's see what's going on for Gemini. What warning messages? Chalice, receptive, quest, and love. So somebody has great love for you, or you have great love for somebody else, but what's going on with that? But someone's trying to escape love. You want to leave you need guidance from trusted sources. You might need to talk to a friend, a therapist, to um, get a reading possibly. You are safe and protected though. You're by your angels are with you right now in this trying time. You're trying to find the right timing to tell somebody that you don't want to be with them anymore. You feel like you're entangled in something. You feel like your energy is being pulled from you. You need to refocus your attention. And you also need to know, you need to know what your intentions are and make them stated. Like you need to state your intentions. What else? You can, somebody here lives in the fantasy world and that needs to come to an end. That needs to come to an end. You got, you're very stuck right now. You're stuck right now. One second. Somebody needs to come back to reality. You or somebody else. You need to come back to reality, Gemini. What else, please? What's this reality we need to come back to? There's going to be a sudden split in a relationship that you don't see coming. Someone's going to be hitting the road, getting away from this relationship very soon it's the escape artist you are dealing with somebody who likes to escape are you like yourself are an escape artist when things are going your way you want to run away you're a runner somebody here needs to stop running from the problems one second Can't run from your problems that only follow you. Can't run from your problems that only follow you. Maybe there's someone following you. Or you want somebody to chase you. That's not fair, Gemini. If you want somebody to chase you, you're not being fair. You're not being fair. What else, please? Yeah, you're, you're juggling. You're juggling relationships. You got cards up your sleeve here. You're playing a game with somebody. You're also letting other people speak for you. You're running. You're trying to escape your problems. And you're people pleasing as well. You're going to get played here. There's no, care, there's no clear communication between you and somebody else. And you're going to play yourself. Because you're running. You're trying to escape a situation. I'm here and you're trying to escape the consequences of your actions or lack thereof. And you're only playing yourself. You're playing a game, but you're in, you're gonna end up playing yourself. What 
What else for Gemini? What is this about? You lack courage. You're you're being petty right now in your relationships or you're about your security. You're going to end up getting karma if you don't stop. You're not going to have victory here. There's third party interference. Now, that third party can be a person, place, thing, something that you're doing too much, but there's an interference here. It could be with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Somebody who likes a lot of attention, or this is you that likes a lot of attention from third parties. There's no, it's empty victories though, Gemini. You like to get a lot of attention from third parties, but there's no victory in that. You like to be the center of attention, but there's no victory in that. And you're also a runner. Come back to reality, Gemini. We got a attention sinking. You're trying to get attention from others to escape your problems, but your problems are still going to be there. Your problems are still going to be there. Yeah, you need to use your sword your sword here. This is you showing up. You need to use your sword here of discernment and truth. Be very clear. Give clarity. Be clear with yourself as well. You don't have proper boundaries, okay? You're very defensive at this time. You're acting, you're pulling back, but you're running away from your problems. You're rejecting offers, possibly jobs as well. You're stuck in your head. You need to get out. You're ruminating, and somebody is trying to come in and apologize to you, or maybe you owe an apology to somebody else. But you need to stop running from your problems to stop attention seeking. That's what they're saying. Stop the attention seeking. And stop running from your trying to run from your problems. Your problems will still be there when you get back when you can try to run away from them. You got a tower coming in that's gonna rock your world. The whole foundation is crumbling. Wasn't built on solid foundation to begin with. Show me this tower. Sudden re revelation, realization as well. This is going to be like a shock a shock to you. What is a shock to Gemini? Somebody's holding back their emotions. They have deep love for you. Um, they don't want to be committed anymore. They maybe have lied to you or they feel like you're lying to them. They want to release you. They feel like you're very toxic. They feel like you have no balance. Very chaotic person that you're not stable on your own two feet here. You don't want to collaborate with them. You're not trying to work with them. You're not doing things on the up and up that means you're hiding things you're not trying to heal things you're just constantly wanting to fight with them your immature communication style is sucking really bad right now you might drink too much or you might communicate immaturely when you've been drinking or under under the influence of substances somebody else though is recovering though from your from you yeah they're going to be dropping you soon yeah they're trying to manifest a way out while you're while well, meanwhile they do care for you and they do love for you they do love you but they don't want to deal with your pettiness anymore they don't want to deal with the childishness anymore they want you to grow up stop attention seeking stop trying to run away from your problems stop stop trying to escape your problems deal with them somebody here wants you to deal with your own personal issues yeah you are crying over spilled milk you're keeping secrets you're not learning your lesson. You're going to repeat mistakes of the past because you're not learning your lesson. Let's see. Let's get you some guidance. Learn from this or be doing repeat it. Yeah, karma is a bitch, you got. You're being unfair on the situation or to yourself. You might be getting what you deserve instead of what you want. What else, please? Karma is a bitch, man. If you, if you keep trying to run away from your problems or escape be an escape artist with them okay and stop in attention seeking you're going to get the wrong kind of attention from spirit and they're going to bring you in that tower you got shine bright like a candle you will make it through this you will make it through this but you've got to know what your problems are you got to deal with your own personal shit gemini you got to deal with your personal shit no one's going to do it for you what else please for Gemini release work with Archangel Michael to let go of what no longer serves you or your purpose exactly you need to release the burdens of the past 
you're holding on to trauma and you're holding on to the past as it, like a security blanket and you need to let it go. Stop trying to escape your problems and deal with them. Come back to reality, Gemini. Stop the attention seeking and run away from your and running away from your problems. They're just gonna follow you. You need to release. Release the past. Release the trauma. Learn to forgive yourself and others. Release it. Let it go. You will make it through this, but I'm just telling you, you gotta you got major towers coming. Okay? See who you could may, maybe be dealing with. If this isn't you doing this, it could be someone around you. Okay, or a situation around you. You've got Scorpio, Sagittarius, Capricorn, Libra, Leo, and Virgo. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus placements, okay? All right, Gemini, that has been your warning message. I hope this helps you and finds you well. Please like this video. Please comment if it resonates. Comment if it doesn't. Roles can be reversed. Remember that. And everything is subject to free will and the will of the divine. Um, no one is free from law of cause and effect. And yeah, if you're new here, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit all notifications. That way, you know, the next time I upload and as always, Jim and I, please get your shit together. I love you. Please take care of yourself until next time.